Hey, what's up guys? Shardimus Prime here, checking out MarvelousNews.com and seeing that Hasbro has released official images for the Black Panther movie wave. And we're looking at Namor right over here, which we've seen uh, several times before already. But I'm still very excited for this Namor figure. It could be the very best Marvel Legends Namor figure. We're also getting a new Black Bolt figure. A good upgrade right over here with those two head sculpts. And it pretty much looks like the same thing as the SDCC version, but we're getting more of a midnight blue color on this figure as opposed to just the flat black. Then we're also getting the all new, all different Avengers Iron Man suit right over here. And I'm very excited about this one, especially because we get that alternate comic book version, Tony Stark head sculpt that we have been waiting for for quite some time. And then we also have the movie figures, which I'm a little bit less excited for. I mean, I'm happy we're getting a new Black Panther figure. This does look new. They may have reused some parts from the Civil War Black Panther figure, but we're getting that new head sculpt, and we're getting that Okia build a figure head sculpt, which I'm going to get into a little bit, which is just a little bit disappointing. But we also get the Killmonger, the Eric Killmonger figure, which is cool, which, by the way, I don't know, as far as, like, the Black Panther villain, I'm not always the biggest fan of, like, the villain that looks like the hero, you know, like the Iron Monger versus Iron Man in the first Iron Man movie, but anyway, that's a new figure, and I'm probably going to be excited to have it because the movie already looks really good. And then we have Nakia, and she looks pretty awesome. It looks like there's a lot of details in this. From what I remember from watching the trailers, uh, it looks like it's going to be kind of like a spy movie, and seeing the female characters in this trailer, or in the trailers so far, it look like these are going to be actually figures that you're going to really want and then going on to the build a figure okoye okoye but yeah she's played by denai guerrera and i think denai is beautiful and i think she's going to play the heck out of this character but as far as getting this as a build a figure uh, i gotta say i'm disappointed man i wasn't happy about it with the mantis build a figure and in that wave uh, we've gotten some larger characters to kind of make up for it so i felt like okay well at least we get some big characters for just regular retail price but not in this particular situation man so this is a little bit frustrating, and there's a number of characters that they could have gone with to make a Build-A-Figure. Now, I'm not against having an Okoye character in action figure form, but I would have liked to have seen, like, Man-Ape. Uh, that's, like, one that comes to a lot of people's mind. Uh, I gotta give a shout-out to x Man 87 because he threw in some names like a Morlun or a Midnight Angel or a Dora Milaje. I'm not, I'm not familiar with that character, but, yeah, there, there's a lot of characters that they could have gone with over... Uh, an Okoye Build-A-Figure. So this does feel like a step backwards. I think a lot of people are going to be upset about this. I personally am disappointed. I mean, I think, again, I think it should be a cool figure, and I think the female characters in this movie look like they're going to do a lot of cool things. So I'm not against getting the figure. Just getting the figure as a Build-A-Figure frustrates me. Uh, I really feel like it's a missed opportunity uh, that they didn't give us a man-ape. Especially, they could have used that Sasquatch body mold already. We know they have it, so they could have just, you know, give, created a new head giving it a different paint job and added some little thingies here and there, you know, and then boom, you got man ape, but no, no damn man ape, man. Oh, well, man, man ape. Yeah, I'm wrong, man, man ape. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this little update video while I'm on my little vacation away from YouTubing at the moment, as I am now a father of my little girl, Emma. So yeah, I'm in that den bunker mode right now, taking care of the baby and not getting much sleep at all. I mean, really. The baby likes to wake up every 10 minutes. It's nuts. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this little update video. You can see high-res images over at MarvelousNews.com. Follow me on the Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Links are in the description below. And I'll catch you guys later. Peace. Hey, new Shard of Prime videos. Hey, you should click one. Yeah, click on one of them. Or subscribe if you haven't.